Francis Charon is on the headset. So, and then the conversation with Barry Trotz. Both coaches are saying okay. So, what? not sure why, but it's something maybe you missed any. Well, I, I, thanks for throwing it to me. I, I'm, I'm sure it's not a challenge. How about that? <laughs> Nothing a challenge yet. <laughs> I have no idea. Maybe just what? a little of a mistake in the lineup cards, oh, guys. Oh, I boy. think that, that is very key, you know, because that could be a penalty. Well, it's the Backstrom line against the McKenzie line to start the game. And already, Steve Kazari, Francis Sharon, and the crew brought to us by BB&T. I have to do some work before puck drop. Now they're heading over to both benches. This is an odd one, folks. Yeah, and we're sorry we can't report what it is. I mean, that's unfair, but we don't know. Uh, guys, I'm getting the report down here that there's uh, an issue with the paramedics. Oh. There's, uh, oh. yeah, the paramedics are not in position just quite yet. And uh, so I think that's what the holdup is. Okay, yeah, that's why Dave Zanobi, that was the head Panther trainer, D Dave Zanobi in the blue jacket. You see him right there. And that's why he was in the conversation, now chatting with Yarmir Yager. You know, the NHL goes through great lengths for safety here, purposes. Here we go, guys. Wow, everybody's going back to the dressing room. There's, yeah. there's going to be a delay wow. until everything gets sorted. I've never seen this. Obviously, the teams are filing out, going back to the dressing room. There is a horrific, uh, tragic accident outside the building here. We're not quite sure, but it's somewhere here in Sunrise. Oh, wow. And unfortunately, the paramedics that were stationed, that were scheduled to be stationed here at the BB&T Center, had to go to this accident. And uh, that's all the information that we have right now. So uh, there's a, there's an emergency situation that's on outside of this building, outside this uh, building. So that's the reason why all the paramedics had to leave this facility. So uh, and the protocol in the National Hockey League is those paramedics have to be in place before they drop the puck. They have to be there here, obviously, throughout the game. And then they they do not leave until both teams give the OK after the game is over that there's no medical emergencies, obviously, with the players or the staff.